In this video, we're going to create a wallpaper in Job Editor. We're going to start with one pattern file that we're going to create a step and repeat for. So I'm going to begin by opening my file into Job Editor. The instructions for this file is that it will step and repeat to fill a maximum available printable width of 36 inches. I currently am working with a 42 inch roll so I'm going to create my step and repeats by going into the patterns tab enabling step and repeat and then I'm going to increase my horizontal and vertical repeat counts to accomplish that dimension of a 36 inch width and height. I'll start by increasing my horizontal repeat count until I see that my overall size and the width has accomplished the 36 inch dimension. Then I'll continue and do the same thing with my vertical repeats, just increasing that count number until I can accomplish my maximum goal of a 36 inch amount for the height. So right now, based on my instructions, I've got my step and repeat pattern for my wallpaper to be 36 by 36. If there were any other items I need to select, I can make these choices. Otherwise, at this point, I'm going to also set a print count for two. So I'm going to go to my print tab and change number of copies to two. And then I'm going to submit this over to my RIP. At this point, I can see my file has completed processing. I have my number of copies count set to two. And in my print preview, I can see my files that are ready to print. I would select print now and print my wallpaper work. And there I have it, my created wallpaper for a size of width and height of 36 inches using my step and repeat feature in Job Editor.